Hi everyone, this is Kim from Money and Risk. I'm going to be walking you through on how to sign up and set up your Hootsuite account. So bear with me, this is new for me because it's been a while since I set up my own. So what you're going to be doing is that you're in Hootsuite main page, you're going to click on the sign up now, it's a little green button in the middle. It's going to lead you to a very simple sign up page, you don't have to download anything. So here you're going to put in your email address. And then you can choose to put either your real name or you can put, you know, anonymous name, whatever is your preference. Again, it's something you have to uh, determine for yourself first and make sure that it's consistent. All right, so once you put in a password here, you're going to choose your time zone. We're on the, e uh, on the West Coast, so we're going to be using Los Angeles. And I don't want to subscribe to Hootsuite newsletter. I've already got that, um, and I really don't want to see any advertisement. So I'm going to click that off right there, and I'm going to choose Create Account. All right, typical. We now have a problem. It says my password does not match. I don't know why it was identical. Let me try it again. All right, it finally took that. So now it says my account has been set up and a email has been sent to my email address to activate my account or I can put in a code. So once you check your email and get your confirmation code, what you're going to do is copy and paste it and then confirm. And it's going to load up and you will see the same thing that you'll see be, uh, at the next tutorial. Now what you're going to see here is that you can choose as you like it Twitter native or classic retweet. My preference is that I want to do um, retweet style retweet be the old ways because I want to be able to edit my retweet. Sometimes people put way too much information in there and I just want to be able to keep it short and sweet. So that's typically my preference. I'm going to save that right and here you're going to choose your Twitter account and you want to connect with Twitter okay so what we're gonna do is I just created an account for her on Twitter for her blog so I'm gonna click connect with Twitter I'm gonna before I do that I'm gonna say automatically create a new tab for this profile it's gonna be yes um, I'm going to say I don't want to follow Hootsuite on Twitter for update and announcement because I just really don't want to. <laughs> so I'm going to click connect with Twitter and it's going to pull up as you can see an application would like to connect with your account would you allow it and I would allow it and it's automatically setting me up with Twitter now it does that automatically because I'm already logged in on Twitter in her account Twitter API is busy as usual, so I'm going to try again, so I'm going to click connect again. Okay, now she is up and running. She has her account on Twitter, and now she has a profile. So this is her particular profile, and if she was a business, she would be able to add employees here in this area for them to tweet on her behalf and give them access to her account but since she it doesn't have any employees we're not going to be doing that what we're going to go to is the profile setting and let me just check that um, yes we have connect with Twitter and sent invitations we don't have we don't do anything on there um, she doesn't have any avatar right now because it's brand new um, we don't want any RSS feed we're pretty much done so I'm going to go ahead and close this out and see what it's going to be looking like. All right, so now you have a profile up on Twitter. The next thing I'm going to show you is how to set up Hootsuite. 